Light Tracer Render is mainly designed for image-based lighting. You can import existing HDRI maps or even create your own studio lighting environments using the built-in HDRI editor. All related settings are available in the environment widget. Let's talk about it in detail in today's tutorial. First, there are three types of scene environments plain HDRI map and sky. The first is a monocolor uniform environment suitable when you want to create your own studio lighting. You can use it as a background for studio lights that can be drawn on it. A lot of real-life HDR light presets are available in the library. The second type is sky, which is an analytical spectral model of the sky and sun. You can set the elevation of the sun in the sky and the turbidity of the atmosphere. Light Tracer Render will create a physically plausible environment for you. The last option is HDRI Map, which allows you to load a custom environment map from HDREXR formats. For your convenience, Light Tracer Render includes a library of HDRI maps. Open the right panel, find the Library tab, and select the HDRI section. In the Burger menu, there are several useful features, blurring to blur the map, and colorizing to make it monotone with desired color hue. You can rotate the environment using this slider and change its intensity. If you need to create some camera animations or depth of field effect, the HDRI map will not work because it's normally represented as a sphere of infinite radius. Light Tracer has a nice trick to project the environment on the dome. Essentially, it allows reprojecting the lower hemisphere of the spherical panorama onto the ground plane. This way, you can place your model on the ground instead of having it float in the middle of an environment map. The background will still look plausible after the camera's rotation. Reprojection can be controlled with just two parameters, the radius of the dome and the height of the projection center above the ground plane. The next group of settings can be used to adjust the backplate. If left disabled, the environment map will be used a, a background for you scene. Blank makes the background fully transparent when saved in PNG format. Gradient creates a smooth transition between two specified colors. You can change the color and direction of the gradient. If you need a single color fill, simply drag the desired color onto the second. The last option is to use an image as a custom backplate. Thank you for watching and subscribe to the channel to stay updated on new tutorial videos.